Hello, Debbie. Hello, Murray. Yes, that's right. Your art now. Um, what, what do you find your art gives you? Release. Um, uh, release from. Release from. And it, and it shows me. It gives me. Hang on. It gives me more than that. It actually gives me relief from the social pressures of people who look at me and think look at me as useless. I feel society does not utilise my true skills because of my height. Um, and in fact, I don't have arms. Right. I'm only three foot eight. Uh-huh. And I just, I'm like five foot high. A five, five, I keep saying I'm five years old, how high, you know. Yeah. And um, like I've, and I'm quite an intelligent person who's had my own retail store. I run my own ability awareness um, public speaking thing through the schools. Um, so um, art to me, I turned to art about five years, uh, four years after trying to get employment. So probably about eight years ago, seven years ago, I turned to art and interest in art. And uh, I have a girlfriend. I had a girlfriend at the time who was the art teacher at TAFE suggested I do the diploma. And I did that not because I want to do art really because she promised me work in art projects within the community. She said, if you've got the diploma, Deb, I can use you in art projects. Me looking towards trying to get a career in this area or jobs in this area, I said, oh, OK, I'll, uh, you know, I'll do the diploma and blah, blah. And it turned out that I very much enjoy painting. I just, I do enjoy the process of it. I hate the setting up. I don't have arms and I find that uh, there's a bit of an access issue and I don't do enough of it. Um, but when I am actually get to sit at it and be doing it, it's a big relief. Because it also I know I'm developing something that when I look at it I think, aren't you clever? Because I do, I do love my feet. I think those images are just, they're done by an artist. They're done by an artist. And you know what? They were my very first oil paintings. I've never done oil paintings before in my life. So I want to go further. And so I went into art with a frustration about my disability and the way the community treats me. And I just wanted to be not so much clever, but I wanted to feel I could do something that I could be proud of that some people just couldn't do and it was in their face. Mm-hmm. Um, and that's, that's, I know it's, you know, but uh, that's the, that's the long-winded reason I got into painting. I'm hoping that at some stage, like I'm only really getting serious about my art now, 